And now to Senator John Cornyn's appearance today at the state GOP convention in downtown Houston. He got a Texas-sized reception, but it was not the reaction that he had hoped for. Adam Bennett live downtown with this. Adam. Well, Rekha, Senator Cornyn is the lead Republican negotiator in this bipartisan gun reform effort. But a day after he walked out of talks in D.C., he walked into a hostile crowd at the GRB. United States Senator John Cornyn. Indoors out of the summer Houston heat. Howdy, everybody. U.S. Senator John Cornyn of Texas got a chilly reception at the Texas Republican Party statewide convention, especially when he talked about guns. Here's my guiding principle. Make sure good people have guns and that bad people don't. Senator Cornyn said he is passionate about the Second Amendment and told his fellow senators he will not support new restrictions on law-abiding gun owners. That will always be my red line. And despite what some of you may have heard, the framework that we are working on is consistent with that red line. The senator highlighted Republicans push back against tougher proposals Democrats wanted following the Uvalde mass shooting, including banning high capacity magazines. And if there is any lesson we can learn from the recent shootings, it's that America must have a reckoning with our broken mental health system. Cornyn's fellow U.S. Senator from Texas, Ted Cruz, spoke beforehand. He vowed to protect Second Amendment rights, but did not address Cornyn or the bipartisan effort specifically. And if we lived in a sane, rational world, we'd be coming together saying, how do we stop violent crime? We go after the criminals, we go after the felons, we go after the fugitives, we go after those with serious mental illness who try to illegally buy guns, and we put them in jail, and we lock them up, we keep them out of our schools, we keep them out of our churches, and we keep our families safe. One big sticking point from the Senate negotiations has been closing the so-called boyfriend loophole that covers uh, gun rights for abusive dating partners. I did request an interview with Senator Cornyn today, but I've not heard back from his team here on the ground. Rekha. All right, Adam Bennett reporting live. Thank you so much.